back garden which back at it again hi guys so we've got a seed tray update it's only been done i think it was a week ago now not even that so 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 far we've had nothing on the carrots parsnips or onions and loads of lettuce have come up though and the bell peppers are doing amazing Come on, focus on the finger. That's it, there we go. You can see they are actually growing. Now, because we've got some peeking through and these ones are struggling, what I am going to do is I'm going to leave the lid off so that it can uh, get a bit more daylight. We've also got an update on all of the little succulents that we've got because they've been breeding, self-pollinating, whatever you want to call it. God, more fell off here. And see, they've got little hairs. Oh, gosh. Those little hairs. There's another one hanging off the bottom. You just can't see it very well. There we go. Those are roots. So all these that have come off, I'm going to have to collect them all up because they've all got roots on them very carefully make sure not to knock any more off I mean it obviously wants to let go of them otherwise it wouldn't let go of them so there we go guys and that's all of the loose ones so yes this has gone boom and as you can see it started out about that size and then it's just got all these around the other this one's gone massive it looks like a real tree now succulent tree fantastic and obviously we've got these little oh that one's just come off as well see and also these ones have got little hair roots see these succulents like to bunch together so what they'd like to do is they like to fall and then grab onto a little bit of soil and then they try to find other succulents and they pull themselves together. So if you look in here, that isn't just one plant. That's lots of little plants all in there. Hence why you get so many babies. So this is what we've got so far. Yes, that one looks like it's sideways, but it's got a long root on that one. And these have all come off. And we've got these to do. What we're going to do is take them over to our cacti propagation tray. And we're going to add these in. I'll show you on the next video.